हेलो एंड वेलकम टू गेट टू हियर एट छत्रपति शिवाजी महाराज इंटरनेशनल एयरपोर्ट मुंबई टुडे वी गुड बी फ्लाइंग सिंगापुर एयरलाइंस ए थ्री एटी ऑल द वे डाउन टू सिंगापुर मुंबई एयरपोर्ट हैज़ अ फैंटेस्टिक आर्किटेक्चर सिंगापुर एयरलाइंस ऑफर्स दिस यूनिक बैगेज चेक रिसीव इट इज़ रियली यूजफुल एज इट डज नॉट स्टिक टू योर बोर्डिंग पास द एयरपोर्ट ऑल्सो हैज़ प्लेंटी ऑफ ड्यूटी फ्री शॉप्स एंड अदर शॉपिंग एरियाज Our flight today will be the Red Eye Singapore Airlines A380 flight SQ423 from Mumbai to Singapore. So right now I'm in the food court which is at the far end of the common area or the departure hall. You have some great airside views from this area but the windows unfortunately are very dirty. There's my aircraft arriving from Singapore right on time. It's nice to see that Mumbai Airport has ad- adopted some indoor greenery. There are lots of indoor gardens, so this helps reduce fatigue and also makes the airport look more beautiful and modern. Another advantage of Mumbai Airport is that you get great airside views from almost anywhere in the terminal. Also, if you have some work to do and you don't have your laptop, Mumbai Airport's got you covered with these computers that are littered across the terminal. My gate for this flight was 68, which is located on the lower end of the far, further end of the terminal that serves all international flights. Luckily, there was this little sleeping area right next to my gate. Boarding started on time and was completed in a group-wise manner, which led to no no delays or crowding on the aero bridge. seat today was in the second last row of the first cabin of the A380 so the new A380 with the new configuration it had a decent sized high resolution IFE screen you have the reading light and the crew call buttons a USB port audio port a storage space a cup holder a wireless payment dock a foldable table which can be used half open or fully open another unique singapore airlines feature is that the tray table has a mirror in it so kr mama the lower deck of the a380 is massive with tons of space between the seat and the window a blanket and a pillow are also provided there's also universal power outlet at the lower end two for every three seats the headrest was adjustable in height and also foldable to make the sleeping experience better and more comfortable reading lights were also provided unfortunately no there were no personal events Complimentary earphones are provided with three different ear cap seals. The legroom was pretty good. The seat was adjustable and also had this coating so it doesn't disturb the person sitting next to you. This flight was installed. The IFE was installed with Voyager 3D, which is a really good high-resolution in-flight map with multiple views, and it's very adjustable. I personally pre- prefer this flight preview look, which can show you the entire route of the flight. 
it also has this overhead view by which you can pan in and out to see where your exact location is and also has this window seat view so even if you're sitting in the aisle you can see what the view out of the window looks like singapore airlines has a ton of movie tv shows music games and podcasts as you can see the range of movies is absolutely massive from all genres the range of tv shows is pretty good too it has complete seasons and back to back episodes you definitely won't get bored on a singapore airlines flight the windows still haven't been cleaned and it's a little foggy hot towels were provided even in economy class this is a very rare and very unique feature to singapore airlines menus too were provided Singapore Airlines provides complimentary alcoholic and non-alcoholic beverages as well as a meal. I went with the fish fillet option. For this flight the menu was provided both in English and in Hindi. I love Singapore Airlines in-flight safety video as it portrays Singapore beautifully. Before using an evacuation flight, remove any high heel shoes. We pushed back right on time. Unfortunately, it was pitch black outside, and you can't see anything from the takeoff footage. It appears to be 80% full. I like how Singapore Airlines has installed these new mood lightings. They look really good and make the cabin look even better. Shortly after takeoff, the meal was provided. It included a small appetizer, which was a salad, a dessert, which was a tiramisu cake, tea or coffee service, along with some milk, butter. a bread roll fresh from the oven a bottle of water metal cutlery which is incredibly rare in economy class and the main course which was a fish fillet with some mashed potatoes and steamed vegetables it was honestly one of the best economy class meals i've ever had Singapore Airlines has installed Wi-Fi on board with three different options which were according to me pretty reasonably priced. SQ also provides an amenity kit in economy class which is very rare. It contained a dental kit which contained a toothbrush and toothpaste and some socks. It would have been nice to have an eye shade and some earplugs. but it's still nice to have an amen- amenity kit in economy class the crew was incredible they were very proactive and kept providing drinks throughout the flight on this 5 hour flight the crew came around the cabin at least 5 times providing drinks before and after the meal and also before landing the laboratory of the A380 is massive Singapore Airlines offers extra amenities such as perfume and moisturizer. There are tissue papers in the sides. 
and as you can see there's also an individual and a nozzle they also provide toothbrushes extra toothbrushes in the lavatory even though it is already included in the amenity kit the lavatory was very clean and hygienic although these drawers which were meant for shaving kits is empty they had hot and cold water options which is pretty standard they also provide mouthwash along with a cup all in all pretty clean in the seat back pocket you'll find a air sickness bag the safety card Singapore Airlines magazine which is called Chris Flyer Singapore Airlines has a extensive route map across all the different continents this magazine called Chris World which was the in-flight entertainment magazine it summarized the in-flight entertainment movies and tv shows and also gave the new latest added movies and tv shows to the IFA you also have a uh, the magazine called Chris Shop which was the in-flight shopping magazine There was also this card that helped you find out how to connect to the in-flight Wi-Fi. We already have begun our descent into Singapore. economy class is laid out in the standard 3-3 configuration up ahead is the premium economy section which is laid out in the 2-4-2 configuration all the business class seats are located on the upper deck of the A380 and, in, and are the new business class seats of Singapore Airlines overall I had a very enjoyable experience with Singapore Airlines for my concluding thoughts please check out my new video which will be upcoming in about 15 days my thoughts on Singapore Airlines this will be a complete summary of both my flights including the one on the A350 which will be coming out soon anyway welcome to Singapore Changi Airport I hope you enjoyed this video please subscribe for more exciting content thank you for watching